A major shakeup in Republican House leadership is reverberating across Washington. This morning, House Speaker Paul Ryan announced that he will leave Congress at the end of the year. Angelica Alvarez brings us more. House Speaker Paul Ryan announced he will not seek re-election so that he can spend more time with his family. My dad died when I was 16. Uh, the, the daughter, the age my daughter is. And I just don't want to be one of those people looking back at my life thinking I spent more time with my kids when I know if I spend another term, uh, they will only know me as a weekend father. The 48-year-old representative from Wisconsin leaves Congress with accomplishments, including major reform of the tax code. Today, Mr. Trump tweeted, Speaker Paul Ryan is a truly good man. He will leave a legacy of achievement that nobody can question. But Ryan's decision to step away from Congress comes at a time when Republicans face uncertainty of winning seats during the midterm elections. I really do not believe whether I stay or go in 2019 is going to affect a person's individual race for Congress. Ryan served nearly 20 years in the House and is one of the youngest to be elected Speaker of the House. In a closed door meeting earlier today, he received a standing ovation from colleagues and even shed some tears. He leaves a tremendous legacy uh, and he achieved his uh, ultimate career goal of comprehensive tax reform and we thank him for being an outstanding leader of our conference in our country. Ryan's departure opens the door for new leadership with Representative Kevin McCarthy and Steve Scalise seen as front runners. In a statement, Speaker Ryan said he will serve out his full term, run through the tape and retire in January. Angelica Alvarez, CBS News, Washington.